Morning, I wanted to show you um, how you can access the vids and the uh, settings on a Contour Roam 2 when you're in the field without having to carry around a couple of um, spare SD cards that have been pre-formatted for um, different settings, uh, which is the sort of most popular uh, fix for the absence of a, of a screen on this camera. If you've got an Android phone, what you need is a a USB on the go cable. Now this is a, a Samsung phone, Samsung Galaxy 2. It is not rooted so it's um, perfectly stock um, with the exception that the uh, the firmware has been upgraded um, to Jelly Bean. I think this is 4.1.2 and the way you um, the way you can access the Roam uh, with the phone is, is, is as follows. Plug in the USB cable uh, that comes with the Contour 2 into the OTG USB lead and plug that in to your Galaxy. Get a message at the top there, mass storage connected and it'll automatically open up the My Files app. If you go into All Files, in this instance it's added <coughs> the contour as a USB drive A. Open that up, scroll through, DCM, DCIM folder, 100 media folder. Here's a vid that I did a couple of days ago just to test this. And there you go, I can review that vid and if I was out I could be checked to see whether the settings were suitable for the the conditions I was actually filming in. If I then needed decided I wanted to change the settings then I find not the default RTC um, text file but this FWRTC text that's got all your settings there. Take a backup copy of it, save it as, as something else that you'll remember in case you need to um, delete your changes. Change this update to, to Y and then change the settings here according to what you want to achieve using the, the glossary that's shown further down on the text file. Once you've made your changes, save the file and then come out and you will have then reset the contour room to do what it is you then want it to do. So there you go. Accessing the contour room too without Wi-Fi in the field. Cheers.